planet Earth. It's a beautiful place and I'm so grateful for it. It provides us with all of the resources that we need, just the right amount of sun exposure, and a perfect temperature for us humans to live and ultimately thrive. But sadly, many people take the environment and this earth for granted with all of the pollution and resource wastage that we see nowadays. It takes all of us to collectively do our part to protect and preserve this one and only planet, this one and only environment for future generations to come. It's our one and only home. And there are many ways that you can contribute to a better, cleaner, and more sustainable environment, many of which you have heard before, such as carpooling, driving less, taking shorter showers, picking up trash, turning the lights off, recycling, and shopping locally. But one of the best ways to protect and preserve the environment is to change the type of foods that you eat. And this doesn't sound as common, but it is one of the best ways to contribute to a healthy environment. And that is eating lower on the food chain, which essentially means eating plants instead of eating animals that ate plants. It's more eco-friendly, and here is why. Eating lower on the food chain, like eating plant-based foods instead of animal-based foods, is much better and much more sustainable for the environment for many different reasons. When you're eating plants instead of animals that ate plants, you're ultimately using less food and water resources because previously those resources were given to the millions of animals in animal agriculture. And a positive consequence of using less food and less crop resources is contributing to less deforestation because it takes a lot of land to plant all of the corn, wheat, soy, and oat crops to feed all of these millions of animals. And a positive consequence of contributing to less deforestation is contributing to less animal habitat destruction, which deforestation and animal habitat destruction are the biggest reasons for species extinction rates. So that is another positive consequence of eating lower on the food chain. And also eating plants instead of eating animals that ate plants causes less pollution because the animals and the factories that produce these millions of animals pollute many unnecessary pollutants such as carbon monoxide, carbon dioxide, nitrous oxide, and methane, for example. So eating lower on the food chain is better for the environment because you're using less resources, you're contributing to less deforestation, and you're polluting a lot less. Every single time that you eat, you ultimately have the choice of whether or not you want to contribute to unnecessary amounts of food and water wastage, pollution, and deforestation. You have the choice between animal-based products like meat, dairy, and eggs, or plant-based products like fruits, vegetables, grains, and legumes. You have the choice. And my invitation in this video is for you to be conscious about your choices in your life and the effects that they have on the environment, our one and only beautiful planet Earth. So be conscious about the effects that your choices have. And I invite you to eat lower on the food chain, eating plant-based products instead of animal-based products because they are so much better for the environment. And ultimately, I wish you all a happy Earth Day. Enjoy the planet, be nice to it, and live in harmony with it as best as you can. So enjoy the rest of your day or night or whatever it is, and I will see you all in the next video. Peace out and happy Earth Day.